I am really, really shocked and uh, impressed with this. Thanks for the upgrade to the premium suite or junior suite. Whoa, this is the most beautiful four point I've ever seen in my life. So the room number for our stay will be 1069. It's a very kinky gay number. Then I uh, come inside here, you get this uh, guest washroom. Then uh, it has a green tea hand wash. I will try the fragrance later with the Japanese bidet. Then this is an uh, area that you can leave your baggage. And here is the living room. I am wow with the view. So uh, you get this uh, door to uh, check out the city view. It's called city view right over here. Uh, the airport is somewhere around there. So if you sit here, you can spot the airplane. Then uh, super comfortable. They do offer the humidifier. Wow, that's lovely. And I have to thank them again. Uh, they are offering this... Uh, Welcome gift. It looks super cool. It's called Salted Cake Dream Cake. And also the complimentary Wong Wong. Uh, so a lot of people love this, but this has some uh, very bad negative uh, case last time about anti LGBTQ. Then here's a mini bar. Very cool Ely capsule coffee. Grandma uh, Nana tea. <laughs> For, uh, drinking water. And. Uh, it's the way to teach you how to operate the coffee, uh, coffee machine, the kettle. Then the fridge is, wow, fully stocked fridge. I'm sure it's chargeable. Let me see if I can find the price list. There's no price list here though. Maybe it's free, but uh, usually I try not to take it. Let me show you the room, the, the, the bedroom, bedroom, bedroom. Amazing. And then... Uh, it is a uh, harbor view. It's super cool. Tomorrow morning, we are going over there to the uh, fishing tour. So you will round around the island and then like go somewhere to fish if I'm not wrong. And the free flow oyster. <laughs> and check this out. Oh my god. It's really the most beautiful four point hotel I've ever seen. So at the bedside, there's uh, two USB port, all the switches for the light control. Amazing TV right over here. Then uh, three, no, oh, sorry, one universal power plug here. And I think this should be the light and the alarm clock, the remote control for the TV. I'm not sure if whether it's a smart TV with uh, Netflix or YouTube all in. So here is a place that you can also place your baggage. And uh, oh, this is a door. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Then uh, here's a working deck. If you open all the curtain, it will be a beautiful view for you. And uh, that's okay. Just set on the system so you can watch the TV. Let's see if it has a smart, uh, what they call. Oh, this are the menu uh, for the French page. Let's say Netflix. Okay, I guess. Oh, okay. It does not uh support Netflix, but you can use download the uh, Netflix app. Let me off it and put it back here. And this is a really freaking huge uh wardrobe. The safe here is totally big enough for me to put my laptop. Then uh, <laughs> sorry for the noise. It's a, you can just put the whole month or two months or three months of the closet here. Really impressive. So there's a walking deck. Um, the switch for the light. USB port, HDMI port. The LAN cable, universal power plug. The spa price. The laundry, or the laundry service. But there's a laundry mat if I'm not wrong. I am going to show you something crazy. Not this one, yeah. Oh, there's a comment on this. I'm going to show you something crazy, which is the bathroom. <laughs> so, spacious, right? <laughs> you can do your stupid TikTok thing, TikTok dance. Then here is a toilet bowl. 
with the Japanese bidet over here, and they will they will not provide those at two two to brush to paste anymore, uh, because of the what they call, they want to be environment friendly. So yeah, you have to bring your own thing. Oh, then uh, the the bathtub. <laughs> It's super cool. I'm going to soak here for sure. And you can literally uh, leave out this uh, view. Oh, it's not working. Why? Oh, then, uh, then you can have the view. And a shower right over here with the uh, shampoo, hair conditioner, and body wash right over here. And also the way to teach you how to operate this. And the uh, bathrobe and the uh, hair dryer looks like a good hair dryer, very big one. Yeah. I am really, really excited with this. Oh my god, look at this. I'm going to shower right over here. And oh, I think that's a thing that helps you to escape in case of fire or this thing for the balcony. And oh yes, that's one thing I also need to share with you that most of the Taiwan hotel, they will prepare this one for the escape in case of the smoke present. So it's a very cool gesture that to keep the hotel guests safe. So I'm going to take photo of the 360 photo and then do the B-test. very soft okay it's not like most of the regular uh four point hey! oh and i don't see much more of the dust like floating after i jump it's slightly bouncy but it's still acceptable and the pillows are tools are the same quality types of the pillow is a good support pillow i really love this room i think i will not leave the room <laughs> amazing let me show you the breakfast area this is what you can get for the breakfast uh, let me start, start start from the cold cut salted egg fermented bean curd then uh, these are the small cold dish this is my favorite the fungal then uh, pickle of bamboo shoot spicy bamboo shoot can be a little bit smelly like a ammonia smell but it's tasty too pork floss hard boiled egg and uh, congee so the next one will be the oatmeal looks like this 
then the soya milk is good for protein and the corn milk corn soup <laughs> sounds very weird to me then uh, these are the cereals four different types of cereals and the cold milk and uh, if you come to Taiwan you really need to try this uh, braised minced pork with the rice I think the breakfast here looks quite comprehensive and uh, what? Cactus toast? Interesting and uh, these are the pastry, the bread it looks quite interesting, it's very good and uh, the cheese, the salad I tried this uh, baby corn, it's very good and uh, tomato here is always very good as well yogurt then the condiment for the yogurt uh, ew. mustard seed salad <laughs> then the waffle salad and then you have three different types of juices soft drinks then uh, oh you have the syrup for the coffee okay looks quite good and the tea Delma tea Darjeeling English breakfast and then the cut fruits the honeydew looks quite weird though it's very green <laughs> okay now come for the hot food then here's uh, German sausages this is uh, let me see Vietnamese curry chicken it looks very uh, Malaysia to me and this is a steamed pork rib the next one will be the fried noodle with the prawn, it smell good steam fish get steam fish early in the morning then uh, there's a steam egg uh, it's, we call it chawamushi if I'm not wrong and then a little bacon potato and uh, oh the fried bamboo shoot this one can be a little bit smelly then this is a uh, stir fried cabbage uh, the cabbage in Taiwan is really good so you must try the cabbage then miso soup and the pork rib soup so let me go to the hot station there is a ham right over here the bread pudding then there's a waffle onion ring early in the morning and popcorn chicken fries so fried egg they have a sunny side out and the omelette and this is a Taiwanese pan fried bun never tried that before I'm gonna try that the sweet potato, the corn, the dim sum and the noodle stations and this one looks quite good though it looks like a little snack for the beer so they have a uh, seafood soup and uh, seafood vermicelli then there's a uh, seafood congee so here is the breakfast a lot of options here's a gym uh, pretty decent Sorry, that's my uh, tower. So this for your hip and uh, the multiple usage of the weight, cardio, uh, some yoga balls, free weight, dumbbell, hula hoop and uh, app roller. I still can do a decent workout here. Uh, and, uh, not too bad, right? At this uh, outside the gym, you can actually play some of the game. Uh, this is something very cool. You can get it in the uh, night market in Taiwan. Just get the ball right over here and then uh, play with the balancing thing. So drop the balls here, then you can go all the way here. And uh, just right beside the gym, there are some uh, reading material and a lot of the games as well. Massage chair and uh, kids room. Uh, something very cool right over here which is the arcade to play the PlayStation 4 is 50 Taiwan dollar per 10 minutes and get this uh, arcade thing play with this with this uh, if you have kids you can uh, drop them here so I'm sure they will spend a good time over here and the snooker table tennis and I'm going to the sw swimming pool. Here is a changing room and uh, there is a sauna right over here. On off button right over here. Then you get the hair dryer steam room. Every time you use it, you have to switch it on. Turn it off when you leave the steam room. It's like this. So you just like, close the door. 
there is a spin dry and dryer over here uh, sorry the spin dry the swim trunk and the drinking water then you go to the swimming pool from here there is a jacuzzi right over here as well um, temperature is 25 degree which is quite cold it's a sunny day over here today and uh, the swimming pool is uh, overlook at the harbor finally it has a sun for the past three days it was like really really windy and cold I was told that the temperature is uh, oh, fuck, it's freezing cold and the kids are like really can swim there so it's an uh, infinity pool it's quite nice but uh, it's too cold for me so maybe on a sunny day then it will be much better than uh, here is a day bit without a cushions but it's quite nice though you can uh, like literally swim in a pool like this going to check out soon uh, but I'm going to share with you that the sleep quality first so uh, the bed is amazing the blanket is very comfortable the soundproof is amazing as well basically it's no car or motorbike passing after 8 p.m uh, maybe it's a winter I'm not sure about uh, during summer how it goes the water pressure is okay uh, the handheld shower that like you really have to switch all the way to get a stronger pressure uh, water spray out and the bathtub can refill the water within uh, 30 minutes you can uh, feel quite a good, good amount the shampoo is a regular four point shampoo so uh, right over here you can see a little thing like a fan it's not a fan it's a heater the reason why there's a heater here is even though they can set the air conditioner to 35 degree but the uh, it's a central control aircon so when you set up to like uh, 30 degree it will turn into a fan just a fan to blow the wind and then uh, it was quite a cold night uh, I think like 18 degree or 16 degree on the first night we were like oh my god like how can the aircon 35 degrees like, the room is always in 20 degree it's too cold then uh, the second day we asked for the maintenance to fix the aircon for us then we found out they actually you can set up to 30 degree then, uh, but it's 25 is still too cold for us so we got this uh, heater uh, you can request for more than one to uh, warm it up it, it's quite cool and uh, breakfast is okay i think overall the stay experience here is, uh, uh, is not too bad i would strongly recommend to stay here as well because uh, this is the best four point hotel I ever stayed honestly the facility is amazing the balancing board thing is quite fun it's uh I took I spent some time right there to play the game. Then uh breakfast is boring. It's a uh, two days the same thing and then today uh it's the last day and we decided to ride around to uh get some breakfast. You can check out our video that the motor right uh, renter video. Make sure you follow the one that I rent the motorbike because that there are lots of the people they do not rent to the foreigner. So get the one. Uh, yes, I will recommend you to stay here, uh, especially if you can get this uh, premium suite room. It's super, super comfortable. Right, I hope you like this video. Goodbye.